Will Sedge. I'm the Business Development Manager in the Americas for Burks and AWG products. I'm here today to talk to you about the new hardware feature we've just introduced to our 16 and 32 gig M8000 Japer. It's ISI emulation. This hardware feature is available on every output stage and allows you to emulate an arbitrary amount of ISI rather than have a physical trace length in the path. This allows you to uh, use ISI as part of your jitter stress cocktail recipe to test receivers, but be able to vary the ISI quickly, repeatedly, in an electronic manner, either by importing S parameters or defining one or two frequency points for system models. Uh, as you can see on the measurement here I have on the screen, the result is quite cool. One of these traces was uh, done with a physical ISI uh, pathway. The other one was uh, software defined in our instrument and is being emulated. And uh, you, know, you, you can't tell the difference between the two of these. Uh, this is very useful for applications like PCI Express, where you want to be able to use ISI, like other types of jitter, RJ or SJ, where you can quickly and easily change the amount of stress and deliver uh, varying stress recipes without physically changing your hardware or test setup on the bench. Thank you very much for your